hey guys let's fix this issue quickly in the first step we need to press windows key plus r key together to open run then type your services dot msc and hit enter so it will open services window then just scroll down and we need to find out the w van auto config simply right click on it select properties once we're here we need to uh, set startup type as automatic then click on apply then we need to start the service once done click on ok do the same process for wvlan auto config right click on it select properties so it's disabled so set startup type as automatic click on apply click on start so the now service status is running then click on ok and close this window In the next step we need to go to search bar and type your task manager then click here to open it click on run new task select browse button now go to this pc open c drive then go to windows folder in the windows folder we need to find out system32 folder here it is double click on it to open it then just scroll down and find out cmd.exe file here it is so select it and click on open now check this box and click on ok once we're here close all the background windows and we need to execute some commands so type all these commands carefully and hit enter to execute them this solution is applicable for windows 10 as well as windows 11 so don't worry just go for it we will fix this issue for sure so type in ipconfig space slash flush dns and hit enter then type in nat sh we so reset and hit enter after that type exit so it's showing you must restart the computer in order to complete the reset so we need to hit enter and simply restart the system the problem will be solved that's it guys you can also check out our description link to fix this issue quickly and effectively that will be a better way and effective one also and yeah don't forget to like the video please do subscribe the channel